Hello. Come on, Tay. You're gonna talk to me on what I know is you. Taya. Taya. So what's been going on? I feel like I don't see you anymore. I miss you, boo. I know. Girl, I've been working like a maniac. I mean, it's paying off, I have to say, but sometimes I feel like I have no life. Okay. You have no life, but you sure make time for your boo thing. Oh my God. I love him. What? I do. In love already. Didn't you just start dating this guy? I know it's only been six months, but it's been an amazing six months. It's like every day we're getting closer and closer. I don't remember the last time I saw my own apartment, girl. Hmm. This must be serious then, huh? Yeah, but... But what? I don't know. Sometimes I just feel like it's too good to be true, you know? I mean, we have so much in common. Our connection is so deep. We never argue in the sex. I never thought I would say this, but I think he's perfect, Mom. You needed this, because that motherfucker Kai had you spiraling all the way downhill. Don't remind me. No, but for real, I think Sean's good, though. Just don't fuck it up. What's that supposed to mean? It means it's OK for you to be happy. Stop expecting for something to go wrong all the time. You're right. You know what's so crazy? I almost didn't talk to him. Like, something was telling me to keep it moving, but he was way too sexy for me to walk away from. <laughs> I hear that. <laughs> so, Sean, Taya tells me you're from Long Island. Yeah, well, sort of. I grew up in Long Island, but I was actually born in Brooklyn. Really? Yeah. What part? East Flatbush? I don't know if you're familiar. Oh, I'm familiar. I played ball at Tilden High School. I went to school in East Flatbush. That's crazy. My mom was a guidance counselor there. She told me some stories about Tilden, man. That school was rough. Hmm. No, I can tell you some stories. It's a lot different now, but back then, you would not want to grow up in that neighborhood. I heard. I think it played a big part in my mom wanting to leave. She was like, there's no way I'm raising my kid here. Yeah. Your mom made the right choice, young man. Well, you know what they say, if you can't change your environment, change your address. And if you can't change your address, you change, change the, the people, people you associate with. <laughs> wow. I haven't heard that saying in years. Hmm. How old are you, Sean? Well, I'm 27, but some people say I have an old soul. <laughs> Nothing wrong with that. Age is a concept made up by humans. Let me ask you something. What's more important to you, getting married or having kids? I would have to say getting married. Really? Why? You okay? I'd just be afraid. I never knew my father. Sometimes I wonder if being a shitty father's hereditary, you know? Like, how could you just bring a, a life into this world and then you just bail and not check in? I mean, you wouldn't want to know. I'm sorry, babe. Anyway, what about you? I mean, ideally, I want both, but I have to say to baby. I've never heard a woman say that before. I mean, think about it. A baby's never gonna just get up and leave you one day. 
I've always felt like a child is the one person that'll love you unconditionally. Nobody could take that away from you. Plus, it wouldn't hurt to have a few mini me's running around. Yeah, a few. <laughs> Come here. <laughs> We're both damaged. I know. So what do we do now? I'm gonna take it one step at a time. Or maybe I'll trap you with the baby uh -huh. and he'll force me to marry you. We'll end up Try. happily ever after, just like everyone else. Uh -huh. I just remember my mom wants me to mow the lawn. So. <laughs> what? No, I'm joking. Uh -huh. Joking. Your mom doesn't even have a lawn. <laughs> doesn't she live in an apartment complex? Uh, You're not so quick on your feet now, are you? Nope. <laughs> you make me happy. What's up, Taya? What's up, Taya? Why are you here? You know what the craziest part about all of this is, Sean? <laughs> I thought this was it. You were it. You were my it. I remember telling Mel how you made me feel complete again. Something told me not to talk to you. What am I supposed to do now, huh? Start over? Taya. You know what? It's okay, Sean. What do you have to drink? Look frazzled. Do you want some water? Relax and I'll get you some water. No. I don't want water. So what do you want? I want something harder, something to help me relax a little bit. We can't, Taya. Oh, come on. How many times have we done this? You know we can't. Don't act like you don't want it. I don't care what the results say, okay? I still love you. We can't do this. I can't do this. Just, just use a condom. How much do you really know about this guy, Sean? Are you serious? That's what you called me over here for? Wait a minute, I thought you liked Sean. I do like him. He's a nice guy. I just don't think he's right for you. Daddy, you run away every boyfriend that I have. It's not going to happen with Sean. I'm not even having this conversation. This time, it's different. You can date anybody you want just not sean why you just have to trust me it happened one time i went away to college i never even thought about it again until the night you brought sean over here you know why it's taken me so long to find a good man? 
So I always wanted to make sure they measure up to you. Turns out you're just like the rest of them. You even know who you are. I'm your father. I'm the same man I've always been. Let me explain. Explain? What else is there to explain? Huh? You banged your counselor and went about your merry way, live your life without a goddamn care in the world. Watch your mouth. I'm still your father. I just want what's best for you. What's best for me? You say you want what's best for me? And the same breath you tell me that for the past six months I've been having sex with my brother? <laughs>